everyone, welcome back to German Auto House. How's everyone doing? There is the the King Meister, Herr Meister. That hey is, guys, uh, working on this wonderful vehicle. Yeah, finally, <laughs> finally we start work on this car today. I hope we finish today, but not sure. Too many things need to do. I don't know. I'm really excited <laughs> because I want to check that tune with the launch control, with a barbell, crackle sound, and what power now. I'm really excited. I hope today, but probably tomorrow. Yeah, all parts, we are all parts. Gearbox done. Let's see how fast we can do. GT3, Misfire, our beautiful Cabrio. And finally, we start work on this car. We start work, no steering wheels, no steering, no, nothing just like modify the, uh, the pedal. Oh, no, you're modifying as a Tesla, drive along, <laughs> right? Of course. Yeah, we modified uh, pedal for drive-by-wire system. It's a slow process, but I hope we finish really soon. Couple, two, three, four weeks, maybe. Okay, yeah, let's start work on this Lamborghini and we show by stage what we do and how to do. Okay. Hi guys, this is another day for that gearbox and clutch swap. <laughs> yesterday, we, we think about we finish yesterday, but too many things happens yesterday. One of our favorite car is down and it's really badly down. The problem is with the engine, with the cylinder head or we don't know, but it's a full full engine of engine cooling and next week maybe another next week we start to pull out the engine and check what happens inside but it's very bad uh, i hope today i hope today we finish this swap and i will I excited about you clutch is already in flywheel pressure plate with the disc uh, flywheel torque specification uh, 60 newton uh, this clutch ball 17 newton meters now it's time for install it by gearbox and hopefully hopefully today we can check we can check this car Go. 
Okay, folks. Many, many parts already in. Uh, pump, axle, harness, return car bolt. Now it's time uh, we fill uh, gear oil already. I'll sealant over there. And now it's time for installed actuator. I already cleaned actuator inside, it's a little bit dirty and lubricate shaft. Now time to install it back to the gearbox and I think another hour and we can try to fire up and check what's going on. Four lambos. Alex start give his favorite job. Diesel. I think Diesel is the best. best. Yeah, I think everybody knows what he do and why he do. This is famous diesel V6 engine and of course it's leaking engine oil from from oil cooler. From oil cooler. Combination. Okay guys, back to the Lamborghini Gallardo. <laughs> Actuator already here. Tight, seal it, and now it's time for uh, engine oil tank. Here we go. Something interesting. Looks like finally done. Yeah, finally we think it's done. We no, ran it through the gears. Done. This is just done for test drive. Yeah. Right. Check, check how is the fireball. Lamborghini. We yesterday we play a little bit with that, but today we assembled everything back, and of course customer agree about that. 
that game. Uh, okay. The pop up up game? The pop up up, yeah. Um, uh, okay, we assembled everything back. Uh, we test now, it's time to check what we've done by Leonardo. We can use our factory, we have a, uh, all these official Lamborghini tools, but that one is a little bit way easier. Now we can see the value uh, about the clutch new. Oops, welcome back. And clutch shoes, clutch shoes. What need to do, how is check wear index for the clutch? Uh, it's a two value from new and from learn it now. Need this number minus that number. And we get like 0.1 if you do this. And then we need that number what we get from this two value multiply by 14.2 and then you can get the wear index and wear percentage from clutch now it looks like new now after we check measurement what we want to do we want to relearn whole transmission because we we replace gears of course we need a relearn and how to do let me uh, deactivate then we go into adaptation and coding guys always always for any supercar for any procedure you have to keep the good voltage and of course all system ask we need a green self test and this is what this means after remove replace and of course yes you sure? Yes. Follow me, guys. It's automatically transmission. You can see the back right. It's shift, shifting here, and you can see in the front. It's a shifting gear. The, the gearbox, it's shift gear, the actuator shift gear and have a sensor and the gearbox learn what gear and when. Then when you can drive this automatically, little bit adjust everything, uh, key point, but that one is really important things. Shifting back, it's like a sequential, pam, 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 and now self performance correctly and now oops turn off the key and this is important things too turn off ignition and remove the key for one minute because the system reset and adaptate our challenge is done with this with this car. Of course, one more time we take to test drive, make sure everything is fine, and then another project. Today, 458, we get a whole kit of gyro disc and brake pads. Our, our customer wanna mm, remove carbon ceramic rotors and went to steel should be interesting uh it's sometimes people can think it's a downgrade no this is not downgrade uh for racers this is upgrade because people don't like carbon it's it's really expensive and this is not long life if you race carbon rotors and it's not that good. I don't know. It's many, many customers do these things. Welcome back everyone to German Auto House, where today we get to have fun installing these amazing, huge rotors by Gira Disc. Look at these puppies. And the customer wanted to replace these instead of his uh, ceramic rotors uh, and Mr. Herrmeister will explain to you guys 
I think he will explain to you why. I think last time we explained yesterday. That's right about the ceramic. Yeah, yeah, for yeah. Racing. Mm. But today. But guys, this is not downgrade. This is upgrade. And way cheaper upgrade. Way and cheaper. Way cheaper. Think about this. This is whole kit. Whole kit. Cost from uh, one of our partner. We are distributor of this company, Fab Speed. Uh, they sent to us for almost four grand. It's a four thousand US dollars. It's a brake pads and brake rotors. Yeah, and, and one then, carbon rotor. How much? It's a cost, used one. It's cost similar price, to similar this. number to yeah, this. To this. Just think about that. Just a brake pads cost for this car. Twelve hundred bucks. Yeah. How is different it? Yeah. Yeah. Well, but it's not different with the braking stuff. It's not the the rotor is not long life. Oh, the stopping and the yeah. longe longevity of it. <laughs> this is our goal for today. We want to work a little bit on tune file, just to start play with the tune file on this car. But it's not mean we finish today. It's long time, long process. Because you want to do some development stuff with the button, barbell, blah, blah, blah. But one more review, guys. Look at this. This is 2020 G550. And, and it's no any difference between G63 and G. I mean, it's drive safe. Yeah, maybe it's like more luxury note for G63. Interior is really the same. That combo is really nice. This is this is always it's nice combo. Still has the sticker on it. Always nice combo. Black and red. Look at the screens. Dual same screens. than G63. Yep. Oh yeah, it's not same. Sorry, without IMG, IMG yeah. style picture. Engine. Let let me try to pop. Uh. You can do it. Still 4 liter engine. Twin turbo. Yeah. Twin turbo. And but it says 8 mg. Shh. Oh. Okay. Shh. Shh. This is G550. Oh, 550. It's a G5. You, you can you can see the sticker. You can see the sticker 2019 emission class 4 liter engine. But shh. Don't say IMG guys. Oh yeah, it doesn't have the the calipers and the rotors. It's not an AMG. This is standard. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> She's still very beautiful. It's a it's a drive same. It's a drive. It's a completely same. Yeah, that that that. I don't know why they call it uh, 463 body style, but this is like a how's it facelift or I don't know. It's, it's probably like a, facelift, yeah. Yeah. It's different little bit, it looks more nicer and drive different between previous body. It's Very not like nice. <laughs> not bumpy, not not <laughs> yeah. manly, it's more soft. Yeah, more soft, more smooth. Very cool car. Yeah, that car is here for traction device. Pam 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 and Like fridge, right? <laughs> like the refrigerator, yeah. yeah. Boom! Freezer. <laughs> nice. Yeah, beautiful car. And yeah, we, we're waiting for parts. We're waiting for the right parts. And I wanna cry. Ah, oh, because of this one? Because of this one. Yeah, we all did. Yeah, soon. Soon we start to pull out the engine and check what happens inside, how bad that damage. But for today, our goal for today is that beautiful yellow one. Beautiful yellow one. 
and we need to re replace one intake actuator probably today or tomorrow today or tomorrow sometimes sometimes here's the after we took off the carbon brakes installed uh, these I forgot what you call them uh, gyro disc so you got a gyro disc with gyro pads same in the back they look great they look wonderful the for only now, thing for now is shiny the only thing I wish they did the brake pads didn't have a slot for the sensors so that's the only difference but it doesn't really hurt it it's just it'd be nice if they had them yeah but when you start the uh, hear something squeaking metal by metal and so many dusty stuff well no these pads have actually little teeth so wow. it does tell you okay you mean it's like like a uh, japanese style just without like any sensors. other without sensors yeah makes sense makes sense yeah that they start like <laughs> oh boy when that happens beautiful you know our next door so, so, neighbor yeah. has this wonderful car he had it for a while nothing so fancy. many kids love and these childhood dream about this car yeah. short two door gti yeah. it's fun to drive good gas mileage Cheap parts. Cheap parts, yeah. yeah. And he has cars for two. I almost thought of buying Yeah, it. he's like, yeah, almost? No, almost. Yeah. 1.8 turbo. Uh, in, in my childhood, I own MK2 Golf. Yep. Yeah, he has cars many times for two. It's like uh, stage two and with the barbell stuff. Just like our neighbor, we have to take care about this. You gotta take care of your neighbors. Yep. So the G-Wagon is done, this is almost done. Yeah, we need to replace intake manifold actuator bank too. It's vacuum adjuster for like, for flap inside. The, the flap is stuck. That actuator is stuck, some in the middle position is stuck. And have like retarded blah, blah, blah code and car sometime going to leap on. Yeah, we got actuator, now it's replaces like, like this. And this is spider, no room, I don't know. Yeah, with the know. spider bonnet, there's no room. Yeah, we have to lift it up, I think, and take that uh, top cover. Oh, again? Yeah, but, yeah, let's see. Just a download information from the CCU. Well, you guys have a... Yeah, but I hope that break is, is having more life. We hope. <laughs> now it's shiny. We will see. Yeah, we will see. Last time, how long did it last? No, something, something wrong. I don't know. Let's see. Okay. Didn't last long. Yeah. Okay, guys. Have a good day. Take care. Bye. Oh, lunchtime. Lunchtime. Wow.